guys at Jason's here. Before this video starts, I always like to mention that I have this free Discord cook group available for you guys to join. It's a great server with a great staff, a great leader, his name is Rock, you know. That man's a beast, a legend. Um, there's a bunch of monitors, links, very friendly community for sure. Like, if you really want to get into the reselling game, I really advise you to join this free cook group. It will help you a lot with a bunch of release details on upcoming shoes friendly links like I just said like a lot of good information that will help you um, cop some W's uh, enough of that talking let's we'll talk about the brand new shoe that is releasing Tuesday it is a LeBron 17s and they're called I promise I'm not a fan of LeBron's I'm gonna be honest they the LeBron 17s they're pretty ugly that's what I think um, this is just not my type of shoe um, these are coming out on Tuesday the 21st at 9 a.m. retailing for 200 US dollars. Also, if you buy these shoes, Nike is probably supporting the mission of the I Promise School through a charitable, uh, charitable donation to the LeBron James Family Foundation. So if you buy these shoes, you're contributing to build the school and help some kiddos. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, but now let's move on to the colorway. So LeBron is basically back at it again with the crazy colors. Um, this time he has like a turquoise tie-dye design with a backwards Nike swoosh like all the LeBrons have. Um, but the thing I like about this LeBron the most are the laces. Uh, they have many quotes of like determination and motivation, which I really like. If you look into the laces, you can kind of see it if you know what I'm saying. Um, it looks pretty cool. And my opinion, I think those laces do make this LeBron stand out a little bit more. And on my opinion, I think these LeBron stand out a little bit more than the rest. Since I actually kind of like the colors, they're pretty aesthetic and the laces are pretty nice. Um, where would these be available? They'll be available in the House of Retailers. It's what I saw on Twitter and on the Nike sneakers app, like always. Um, it's already loaded in. I'm not sure why the clots aren't loaded in yet. Hopefully they're by there by tomorrow. Um, everybody's kind of freaking out about that. But back to LeBron, um, that's all I know at the moment. They might drop via Foot Locker and all those foot sites, so don't forget to check on those because maybe like last minute they always like to announce the things or like three or four days ago before the drop they like to announce it. Now let's talk about the resale value. Uh, these will basically have no resale value. Like the past LeBrons, they don't really have any resale value, but they will sell out. So. If you want a personal, you know, I hope you cop a personal because these will still sell out just like the more than an athlete. The Brown 17 that sold out, I think like two weeks ago. Yeah, they'll sell out, but they're retailing for like $200, exact same amount. So it's really, you're not really getting any profit because they're either going to resell at retail value or they're going to go even lower. So if you want to, you can hold off on copying them on the sneakers app and then just wait like a few few weeks they should you know lower down on price like on stock x or go um so yeah that can be good if you're really into lebron 17s but like i said no resale on these shoes no resale on any lebron 17s they're all pretty much bricks um but with that being said guys don't forget to like and subscribe and let's hit 500 subscribers before the end of the month like i said january is a pretty dry month you guys have any suggestions anything else I should put in my videos, you know, any other shoes you want me to review. Don't forget to leave it, uh, leave it in the comments. But yeah, with that being said, guys, I will see you in the next episode. See ya.